Ethylene glycol is the ingredient that makes antifreeze tasty. Though colorless and odorless, the syrupy alcohol is delicious. <laughs> Most antifreeze is made from ethylene glycol. Ethylene glycol based antifreeze tastes sweet, but is highly fucking toxic to both humans and animals. Yeah, it'll cause you to go blind and die. Just like a good lie. But we know the truth is bitter. The bitter truth. Bitter, bitter, bitter truth. I speak only in truth here. Things you can fucking touch, feel, see, look at, study, investigate, and come to a fucking rational conclusion. I'm not going to give you something you can't look at. Some folks aren't used to the bitter truth, and that's okay. You can go all over someone else's channel and drink all the antifreeze you want. I do not commercialize this channel. I do not have donate options hooked up to my feeds. We do, however, a confounded moon project. Polly and I are fixing to hit the road. I'm getting out of my comfort zone. I'm going to stop blowing glass so much and start giving to the world what we have found. We're going to be going around making a tour. I am liquidating everything I fucking own. We're buying a fucking RV and we're going to go travel around the fucking country. Eventually, hopefully, to Peru. That's our goal. Oh my God. We're going to fucking go around giving humanity their birthright back. Teaching people how to heal and move water. It's eh, effective on YouTube. Eh. But so many people out there don't watch YouTube. And we need to give this back to everybody. We're going to be hitting targeted areas like the natives. If you have people in your area and groups that want to, to learn, Polly has something to say. Being falsely accused? By a lion ass hat. Scientifically, you owe me an apology. Uh oh. So she's calling Lee out. Uh, well, which, you know, I mean, I can't blame her. Lee's a little bitch and he's been himself the drunk on the job site. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he posted a lot of stupid shit. Anyways, uh, we're taking this to the streets. And we're going to be traveling around fucking giving people their field. You have a fucking magnet in your chest. Use it. So we'll show you the example of a twisted bitch. So the local narc is asking for $50,000 on his GoFundMe page. Because they asked for a fucking goal. And I figured, yeah, we're going to be doing this for years. 50000 isn't too much. Fuck. Gas is expensive. <laughs> to tell you to pull your magnet over your head well he claims you don't have one even though the medical things say we do so he says uh, uh, I would ask for money liars and thieves and murderers always do so I went over here to my page and posted up his fucking wonderful words to himself Lying narcs and $50,000 and liars and thieves and murderers always ask for money. All donations gladly accepted at PayPal. This is all Lee's business here. He's got several different ways to give him money for doing nothing but posting lies. <laughs> so he posts lies that you can verify are lies and he wants your money for it. Polly and I, well, you know, we see a need. We're going to go around healing fucking people and giving them back these things that you personally have found are very valuable in your life that we've been living as humanity without. There's something in that Bible, one of those Ten Commandments about falsely accusing your neighbor. Now, you know what? I have flat out pointed to every video that Scientific Lee has made where he is violating each and every one of those Ten Commandments. Yeah. Each and every one of them. Such a godly man. Well, see, 
now he says, I'm asking for donations. And for two years, he's been vile about my mother. Because, you know, Lee, for two years, you've been lying and doing exactly the opposite of what you claim. This started out with you saying, I had no perpetual motor models. I had no perpetual energy models, no free energy. Now, your argument is it costs a thousand dollars to get a neodymium magnet and a fucking haulback array that create electricity forever. So we'll just go out a thousand years on a non-moving part. So you spend a thousand dollars on a fucking magnet for a thousand dollars that makes fucking electric for a thousand years. You got a dollar a year. It's pretty close to free energy, dude. You can't call me a fucking liar just because you're wrong, man. Okay? The truth is, you feed people antifreeze, and I give them the bitter truth. The truth is not always fucking pretty. I never said anything about it's cool. I'm actually not really happy about having to ask for fucking help with this. But you know what? It's a big endeavor. And I'm not able to do it by myself. And people see value in the bitter truth. Because the end result is so sweet. You actually have a direct connection with the creator in your chest. Just like your Jesus said. I've proven the words of your Christ true, dude. And you sit here and fucking poo-poo everything your Jesus said. If you want, you can bring your magnet to the same frequency as God's first creation and inherit her strength and be a steward to protect all of life in a three-sun system. It's that simple. It's not a stretch of the imagination. It's physics, and I've walked you through it. All you have are angry fucking words, and you keep contradicting yourself. At this point, Lee, you're not just insulting me, you're insulting Pollyanna. Her and I have been friends for over a decade. This lady lives for the truth. I live for the truth because we've been lied to so much, dude. And all you can do is sit over here and cry and whine and bitch for a billionaire. You dropped 180 of your fucking videos and started badmouthing. Said you would apologize if I could bring forth the working models, and I did. And you continue to call me a narc? You know, narc means I'm telling on you. I'm telling the truth on you. You're a narcissist, dude. You fucking lie and make up shit. Just to make yourself feel better, I think. Because it sure as hell doesn't make you look good with a cucumber on your stick. And you laying your fucking dick out for everybody to see online. You claiming you have 89, 90, how many fucking videos now on your fucking playlist? That so-called 90, so-called proving me wrong with a cucumber on a stick. Defying the laws of fucking physics, dude. You're a fucking antifreeze salesman. Period. Trapped in a 
according to the museum. When Tiamat was completely destroyed, that's how the Enuma Elish reads. Earth was trapped in the void that that created. Seven years older than the Bible. You can see these things follow the sun. If you spin it, they go around. Now, Magnet, magnet, hallback, copper, and he holds it still. On the bottom. Now this operation costs about a thousand bucks, and this is what Lee's saying is not free energy. Although this is the the working model for the Dendera box, we have found working models for everything on the freaking field. This is perpetual motion and this one here is perpetual energy lee said i didn't have working models for either of them two years ago i have produced all he asked for and he continues for two years calling me a fucking narcissist to eight thousand motherfucking people every day it's ridiculous and insulting to intelligence the man is a fucking antifree salesman and it's disgusting we're offering truth here. There's your difference. It's fucking bitter. Boiled around the dialect commercial plane. And as you can see, I've got light polarity on the whole back array, so it's on the top. You tell me where this is valuable in itself. This man is creating electricity from no moving parts. None. It's the field that generates it. Around you. Pulling this out of the fucking so-called ether. Forever. It's free energy. <laughs> 